there, HQTs. Magic Mike is bringing his um, talents to London. Channing Tatum hit the streets of Piccadilly Circus to promote the upcoming live show and had a blast larking around with his British fans. Now, a million pounds worth of tickets were sold within an hour of them going on sale. But if you're expecting to see a shirtless Channing, Sadly, he is behind the scenes on this one. I'm Shazza Carpenter, your private quizzer, and this is HQ Trivia, where what you know can get you dough. The rules here are simple. I'm going to ask you a series of questions from easy to hard. You have 10 seconds to tap the answer. You get it correct. You move on. Answer all 12 right. You win or you split that dough. And don't forget, inviting friends to HQ using your code can score you those extra lives. You're allowed to use one per game, just not on the final round. Now, tonight we are giving away a dance worthy £1,000. That's enough to score your VIP tickets to Magic Mike, a gym membership to get ripped like Channing, or a club dancing lesson, and more. But before you blow it, you've got to own it. Let's get to the quizzing. Here we go with Q1. Cats are often said to have which of the following? Three noses, four cars, nine lives. The perfect question to get you started. Now, fat cats fill their garages with Ferraris, but this is something all cats are said to have. Spamming those HQ referrals, they've got nine lives already. Nine lives for the win, 196,000 of you knew that. Their reputation for reincarnation comes from their ability to jump from high up and still land on their feet like you did just now. Q2. How does Father Christmas traditionally enter a house? Through the keyhole, over the hedge, down the chimney, Santa Claus himself, Saint Nick. Now he'll vault the hedge if you live in a maze, but that's not his traditional method of entry. Leaving through the keyhole to Keith Lemon, he comes down the chimney, sometimes gets stuck though. 193,000 of you didn't get stuck on this one. It's been his preferred entrance since the 1800s, but goblins have been using it for centuries. Q3, who finished sixth in the 2011 series of Strictly Come Dancing, Robbie Savage, Barbaric Streisand, Sasha Fierce. They all sound quite intense, don't they? Sasha Fierce, of course, is Beyonce's alter ego, and there is no way she is leaving early. The easy question with the savage answer is Robbie Savage for the win. Sausages all around for 151,000 of you swapping studs for tap shoes. The ex-footballer teamed up with dancer Ola Jordan, giving his celebrity career a kickstart. And it's shout out time. Hello to Matt Pricey. Please hold a World Cup barbecue for your friends in exchange for this very shout out. Hello Joe from the Uni of Nottingham who met his girlfriend playing HQ. How romantic. To Johnny and her HQ BF Bill. Hi to Elliot, Matt and Dan who just finished their first year of medical exams. Well done. Santiago and Antoine who just finished their exams as well. The lads living the Tenby dream in Wales. And happy birthday Gemma Lou and flatmate Charlie as well. Have a good time and good luck to all of you players. Q4. A British wartime poster encouraged people to be like dad and keep what? Mum, the doctor away, off the grass. Just keep calm and carry on on this one, okay? The government is always giving us ways to keep the doctor away, but being like dad wasn't one of them. Keeping our mouths shut, it was keeping mum. And a motherly win there. For 70,000, 729 of you, but we lost 50% of you already, sadly, on Q4. This was just one of a load of campaigns making sure that information wasn't leaked to the enemy. Very important stuff. Q5, when traveling by air, which of these French cities is the shortest in distance to London, Nantes, Lyon, Paris? I have family in France, so I know this one well. Ryanair may drop your miles away from any of them, but which of these cities is the closest to London? From one capital to another is Paris for the win. Paris, of course, and wee, 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 39,782 of you got that right. Now, Paris is roughly 214 miles away, or just over eight marathons if you fancy running there over the water. Q6. Plugging is a combination of jogging and what other activity? Paddling, picking up litter, planting. It's a hybrid of jogging and what? 
I'm more of a plodder myself, but adding which of these to your jog will turn you into a plogger. Getting fit the womble way. Picking up litter. How about that? 24,712 of you with a clean win. Keeping yourself and Mother Earth healthy at the same time. Of course, it was invented by the Scandinavians. No surprise there. Q7 halfway there. Which of these apps set the highest minimum age for creating a new account in the UK? WhatsApp, Snapchat, Instagram. Are you legal? Now they're all home to some pretty adult material, but which one has an age gate to match? Bugs Bunny's favorite is WhatsApp. WhatsApp, Doc? 8,583, if you got that right on. Our first savage question of the game. 16,000 of you gone. I'm sad to say, but 8,583 of you still with us. All three apps had a minimum age of 13 until last month, and then WhatsApp raised theirs to 16. Yeah, caught you out there. Q8, which of these shipping forecast areas is named after a sandbank? Malin, Cromarty, Bailey. What do you know about shipping forecast areas and sandbanks? A lot, I hope. It's the most effective lullaby in human history, but which of these districts is named after the Sandman stash? Bill's boring brother. It's Bailey for the win here on Q8. 3,177 of you nailed that one. Cromarty is named after an estuary, while Malin is named after the Marlin Head in Ireland. Riveting stuff. Q9, which of these opponents did Sylvester Stallone not fight in a Rocky movie? Ivan Drago, Thunderlips, Union Kane. Some strange names of these fighters. They've all stepped into the ring, but who faced Balboa's protege instead? The paper champion of Rocky V, it's Union Kane. Kane, and we have 1,007 of you still in the HQ union here. Stallone fights both Mr. T and Hulk Hogan's character Thunderlips in the third film. He jukes it out with Drago in the fourth. Q10, which of these racing games was released first? Daytona USA, Ridge Racer, Virtua Racing. The only video games that I'm good at. I love to beat the boys in racing. Three classic arcade speedathons, but who started the race a whole year ahead of the others? Feeling 100% real in 1992, it was Virtua Racing. And a very real win there for 364 of you. The word Dotana, Dotana, Daytona blared out of arcades in 93 with Ridge Racer just a couple of months behind it. Q11, which actor's sibling sometimes appears alongside him in a TV crime series. David Jason, Kevin Waitley, John Nettles. No sibling rivalry here. Arthur White is an English stage and screen actor, but which of these detectives does he call little bro? The face of a touch of frost is David Jason for the win. 123 if you got that right. Trotters at the ready, because we are wheeling and dealing into the final round. 123 players are left in the game. We have 1,000 pounds up for grabs. As we speak, good luck players, Q12. Which of these people has posted the most tweets? Bill Gates, Barry Chuckle, Selena Gomez. Who has those Twitter fingers? Three celebs with plenty to talk about, but who's been spamming that tweet button? Gates has put out almost 3,000 tweets, but he's still in last place here, tweeting either to me, or to you, 4,778 times is HQ favorite Barry Chuckle for the win. Who's chuckling now? We have 30 winners, my lovely. <laughs> Congratulations! Massive win there by 30 winners. Well done. You are taking home 33 pounds and 33p. We've got Morgan Evo. We've got Portok. I like the, the little furry cat. 
We've got Lou Curtis O10. We've got JJMB89 with your feline in the pick as well. And a bunch of other winners too. Well done. What are you going to do with that cash? Maybe get some cat treats. She deserves it. Get a cheap flight to France. You'll probably be standing though. Go. It's free. There's a lot you can do with that £33, that's for sure. That was an awesome game. Did you have fun? I hope so. I'm Shazza Carpenter, and you know where to find me at all times, day or night. I'm right here on the socials. Come say hello and let me know how you did today. We've got a lot more cash heading directly at you tomorrow, starting at 3 p.m. You'll have another chance to get your mitts on £1,000. Until then, have a lovely evening and I will see you soon. Bye. Woo!